Hi everybody, welcome back to another episode of Andy Blark Plays This Blind Run. I, in between, in the last episode we got a Pokemon Gym Badge, and I decided in between to level up Merida here, and then I was going to level up Syndrome, but I need to record or something anyway, so let's go. It's Barry! Whoops, sorry Andy Blark, you got the Gym Badge, huh? It turned the city to the next place at the gym that gives away badges, right? Maybe? Oh, I need to get a bike. Okay. Nine. Bah, who's ten? What? What? Oh, I didn't get to fight him? I wanted to fight him. That's lame. Oh well, I get to keep level grinding anyways. Ba ba ba. Wait. Oh! Oh, I know what to do. Maybe. Possibly. I need to catch another Pokemon. <gasps> <laughs> He's evolving! Oh, yes! Yes! Come off, Syndrome! Oh, it's Luxio! It's Luxio! No. He's so cool! Oh! Yes! I'm almost to a Luxray. I'm almost there, guys. I need that Luxray. Wait, 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 Okay. Um, okay. I was not expecting to run into an Abra. Let's see what happens. <laughs> Watch me catch this. I doubt it's gonna happen, but come on. Come on. Is this the luck? Is this the luck of the Irish? <laughs> Oh, I was not expecting to run into a Nabra. That was really cool. <laughs> Woo! Okay. Well, I have an Abra. What should I name it? Hang on. Bing Bong! I know he's not an elephant, but it's Bing Bong! <laughs> I cannot believe I ran into an Abra. That's really funny. Too bad Abra is not super good. Because Abra literally doesn't learn anything. Can you learn Rock Smash? Probably not, but... I have nothing that can learn Rock Smash. What about Return? Can you learn Return? Because if you can... <gasps> he can! He can learn an attacking move. As, uh, you know, I'm probably not going to use him, but... Whatever. Abra's worse at leveling up than leveling up a freaking magic card. Well, maybe not. I'm not sure. It, it really depends. Because Abra, like, doesn't learn anything. There we go. This should work. Uh. It's a female matchup? What the heck is a female matchup? That's creepy. <laughs> Okay, I know this isn't Pixar, this is Overwatch, but... She's just gonna be an Atrium Slave. I don't want her to be, like, my actual team. I'm sorry. There you go. There you go, Zarya. You learned Brick Break. Rock Smash. Moving on. A Psyduck?! What's a Psyduck doing in here? A Big Pearl. Can I get a big diamond as well? Oh, I see. Ooh, a Golbat. Hi, Golbat. And this iteration doesn't have his tongue hanging out like he's like, You know the one I'm talking about. I'm talking about this one. Oh, Flash. I got Flash. I hate Flash. I never use it. Remember in the original game, I tried using Flash, or I go into like that, that really dark cave where you need to use Flash to see where you're going? I didn't use it, because you could see where like the walls were, so using those I navigated it and I was just like, I don't need to learn, teach my, my guys a useless move like Flash. Good times. Playing Pokemon Yellow. Hmm. That was the first Pokemon game I ever played, Pokemon Yellow. I remember I had a level like 72 Pikachu, and I taught a Mega Punch, and it was amazing. 
And I would I would send it out because for some reason I wanted poetic justice. Where am I going? But anyways, I I had him have Mega Punch, so whenever I went up against Gary, I would just be like, use Mega Punch on his Jolteon. It was fun. Where do I go? Oh, it's Looker! Hey, Tell me you have not obtained a pal pad? What? What's a pal pad? Uh I, I, what's he, what is he investigating? I know I'm gonna figure it out in the future, but, uh, no. But seriously though, what is he investigating? Team Galactic? What do I do? Um, I gotta get a bike, but where do I go to get a bike? Uh, uh, wait, I know what to do. I think I know what to do. I have an idea. Oh, hey, stuff is happening. Now, 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 Professor Rowan, you must comply. Hand over all your research funding for free, naturally. Failure to comply will result in a painful time for your assistant. Yeah, recently, as in like four days ago when I started playing this, and now I'm just like ridiculously over level. Number one, don't loiter about for no good reason. Number two, don't interrupt others while they are attempting to converse. Number three, if you don't get your way, don't raise your voice to be intimidating. That these are these are good rules to live, people. Number four, don't think you've grown strong just because you're in a group. Number five, what is those what is with those outlandish outfits you have on? My goodness, you call yourself adults. <laughs> you know, I agree with all those things. If you're in a group and you're trying to be all powerful, it's like, dude, shut up. That doesn't make you more powerful. It just means you have sympathizers. And then, like, I, I don't know. You kids, these thugs, listen, civility, please. Do it. Ooh, Team Galactic, son. Let's do it. Galactic grunts. Look at them doing their less than signs. <laughs> I squash all of your levels. Y'all are done. Ooh. The young fake out, which is like one of the most used thing in competitive. I only know this because I've seen competitive videos. I don't actually take Pokemon competitively. I'm very casual. Yay! You did it, Syndrome. How dare you. Don't touch me. You did it again. Stunky. It's a wild stunky. I don't want a skunk, okay? Nobody likes skunks. Skunks can be adorable. If you like tame them and stuff, but it's still just like it's a skunk. It's gonna smell bad. Fun fact: skunks and ferret, skunks and the ferrets are from the same family. They're related. That's why they both smell horribly bad. It's mad as possible. The mission is a failure. Yeah, like Roran said, his adulting rules. Yeah. Out of your galactic. You and your galactic veteran. That lot, they call themselves in galactic. When Pokemon evolve, they seem to release some type of energy. I believe that it's a mystic power for- Wait, that has nothing to do- uh Oh, okay. I was like, these are two separate things. Like, they're team galactic. Let me talk about the energy of evolution. Mm hmm. Uh, research data by force. That's really unforgivable. I thought they wanted to t uh, wait. Why are they studying evolution? I thought the the main bad guy wanted to just take over space and time. What does evolving have to do with that? Hmm. I'm very confused. I have very many questions. And here's a fat dude. From um, Jubilife TV. A fashion case? Look, dude, I'm not a fashionista, okay? 
I don't want to. I don't want to dress up my Pokemon. I'm not into that kind of thing. I'm sorry. I mean, yeah, I like cosplay and all, but I don't know about animals cosplaying. That's just like eh. the ravaged path. Yes, this is the way I need to go. I was. I am a genius. I was completely right. Should I go back to that lake? Rock Tomb! Ooh. That's actually a pretty good move. I taught my Sableye in my Emerald Nuzlocke Rock Tomb. It was actually really useful. And then I think I replaced it with something else. Hey! Uh-huh, uh-huh. What about you, lady? We're gonna fight? Bring it on. Oh, I hope this isn't too loud. Uh-oh. I'm sorry. I'm sorry if this is like hurting people's ears. But, you know, so be it. <laughs> Aroma lady. But do. I remember in the Azume, uh, Badu opened up its little bud things. And there was like a red and blue things on either side, and I thought it was like really weird. Ta da! I think I figured out how Syndrome's ability works though. I mean, it says. Oh, Cherubi. I will switch. Come on, Merida. And they say there's no fire types in this game. That's one thing I heard, anyways. I heard that there's like hardly any fire types, and I found one immediately. And it even knows Ember and Flame will now, so basically I win. My Ponyta will destroy the masses. And next, ah! The twins have found me! Can one shot this trainer? Oh, I dare you to do that. Y'all are done, son! The double Patrice defense, it's too much for me to handle. I like how uh, Merida's like completely overshadowing, or like right in front of, uh, no, not Spark. Right in front of Luxor Syndrome. She's just like, I'm the real star. Not this uh, Syndrome loser. I'm already too powerful. <laughs> My bad habits of constant level grinding are showing. I don't know why I do it. But I just can't leave the second route until everything's at level 10. It's 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 weird. I know. I'm sorry. I apologize too much. Bullet seed! Now I just need something with skill link and I'll be great. Floroma Town. My matchup will be my HM slave. Because Bidoof is overrated. So, what we got going on in here? Only if they're attracted by Sweet Scent. Oh! That's a Pokemon that I want! I want a, Z I want a Vespaquin. Because Vespaquin's the best! Mm. Snazzy outfit. Am I hunting them? Can I walk in these flowers? Will I die? No. Hello. Um. Berries, I don't care. Wait, where? I want honey. I need honey. Hello, Team Galactic. I'm with Team Galactic, and we're assigned here. Standing around among flowers, this doesn't seem all that cool. Hey, now, don't complain. This is a pretty decent assignment. But bug and grass type Pokemon so creepy. What? Grass types? They're not that bad. Uh. What am I supposed to do? I have like no- oh, I was already in here. I have no idea what I'm doing right now. 
Ah, maybe I should actually pay attention to what the story tells me. Uh-huh. Oh, I got a Rossberry. That's useful. Uh, nope. <laughs> Googly specs? What do those do? I got a spray duck. Yay. Uh... Okay, I'm gonna go on to this route now. What are you doing? I want to see my papa. My papa lived in the valley. I wouldn't work for when a whole bunch of people dressed like spacemen came. They kicked me out and they're making my papa do something. Um... Oh. Hi! We Team Galactic are conducting research on the Eternal Forest. This is as far as you will go. Our research involves catching Pokemon in the fly as a flow. We are also covertly stealing the energy of the Valley Woodwork. Thanks for telling me your plans, you dork. Oh, fine. Well, can't do that. What do I do? I guess I need to go this way. This is what I'm assuming. But I think I'll leave this for the next episode because I've been playing for a little bit. Well, let's see if I find anything you interesting here first. Let's see if I find a cool Pokemon. I found a Pachirisu. But I don't want a Pachirisu. Because I don't need a Pachirisu. Because I got Syndrome! Let me try one more time. Let's see if I find another Pokemon one more time. Ooh! A Blazel! I should not have switched. Oh well, whatever. I don't think I want a Bleasel though. I, I, I mean, I could get a Bleasel. But I don't know. I don't know, man. Nah, I won't get a Bleasel. I don't need a Bleasel. Um. Okay, now I really am gonna end it. So, tune in next time, probably tomorrow, when I go in here I'm completely flying blind at this point I'm just like I think it's my fault though because I'm not listening to the story when I'm supposed to be because I feel like I'm not entertaining enough which I'm probably not but you know what I mean so uh, a lot of data so thank you so much for watching today's episode and be sure to tune in next time when I actually do some more plot like stuff bye everybody good night